I am lit right now. I was filming a reel over there. I don't know if you can see. No, you can't. It looks so majestic though. It's a rainbow. Dude, I'm so lit right now. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I got really lit. I'm also very pink right now. Kind of look like a tomato. I'm hungry and I have some leftover Chipotle. Wait, first of all, hi. How you doing? So tomorrow I'm doing something pretty fun. Not gonna lie, I'm a little anxious though. It's just because when I travel, I usually travel with my boyfriend. I don't know, I just like feel safe with him and stuff like that. But my best friend and I are actually gonna go do something together. We're gonna go see Hippie Sabotage. And the concert is like two hours-ish away from us. And we got a hotel room and I'm, I'm so fucking pumped. I'm so excited to see Hippie Sabotage. I haven't seen them in a few years. It was kind of always like a little tradition to go see them in my area. They would always have shows here. We're gonna go see them. Totally forgot, I need to pack shit. So I think I should probably do that tonight. I'm leaving tomorrow, which is Saturday. Not sure what time though. I just like don't really feel like rushing and getting shit together right before leaving because that's usually what always happens. I don't need to pack really a lot because <laughs> it's it's just one night. I do know what I'm wearing so thank god I have that figured out. It's so hard for me to not pack my entire closet. I just need like a thousand things for barely a day. I'm always thinking I need like extra stuff. I don't. Here's my leftover Chipotle. It's kind of not hitting as hard as it was last night, not gonna lie. I got chips too. I also devoured this giant Reese's peanut bar. Peanut butter bar. What the fuck? I can't read. This is the best thing to ever exist. Just saying. Somebody. and packed and good to go. I'm just gonna shower, take off my makeup, get ready for the night, and then probably film tomorrow when I leave. To go see Hippie, eight, 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 eight. I'm excited. The next day. hotel room is so nice like what the fuck so toilet hey nice shower oh my god the shower is everything i look like a 12 year old boy <laughs> literally probably gonna do my makeup right here got some cheez it's this view though oh my god I'm so glad it's not raining. <laughs> that would suck. Oh, gorgeous. So dope. Steven's universe? <laughs> Pink Panther? Wait, Dude, that's so I'm, sick. I gotta take a picture, okay. Oh my god, Snoopy. <laughs> Wait, that's so cool. Pizza. Got some stizzy joints. Oh my god, actually that looks so fire. <laughs> that looks so good. Honestly, I'm gonna just like turn on some music and like roll some joints. Oh, I should have brought a tray. I know. Ooh, ooh, got the cheese bread. Figure it out. Oh. Oh. Gorgeous. <laughs> Are you kidding me? It's a vibe. Fit check, yes. <laughs> give it a twirl, give us a spin. <laughs> yes. Oh my 
Yes.
trying to fucking chill with the boys. <laughs> Dude, I'm fucking weak. We're this close. Dude, oh my god. <laughs> We're like, we got the weed, bitch. We got the blunts. <laughs> we really do got the blunts. A, 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 a. <laughs> the next day. Bro, I look like ass right now. <laughs> Ugh, I like don't even want to show my face. We woke up, checked out, and now we're here. Probably gonna go smoke a blunt somewhere since I have a blunt rolled. So I might go do that. <laughs> And I also look like I'm in the Matrix with these sunglasses. <laughs> Nothing better than listening to Frank Ocean by the ocean with a blunt. Hopefully it will like because it's a little windy. I rolled this fatty last night. I haven't rolled a blunt in such a long time. I rolled this pretty good. I struggled for a minute, 
but the wraps were kind of ass low-key because there was holes in like most of them but this one's pretty good This beanie is exactly how I feel right now. A shit show. Hey, what's up? So it's like two weeks later from when I filmed this video. <laughs> I completely forgot to end this video, but I didn't just want to like cut it off, you know? I wanted to sit down and chat for a little bit and give a little recap of the concert. The concert was absolutely amazing. I love Hippie Sabotage so much. I had a really good time and me and my bestie, we've been listening to them since beginning of high school so they have a really special place in our hearts they're also from our hometown sadly though they didn't have a concert here so the closest one was about two hours away from us so we were like hell no nah, we ain't missing this as you see my boyfriend ended up coming later in the night we also met the brothers we met Kevin and Jeff we were telling them like y'all you need to have a concert at our hometown like come on now yeah anyways they're just super chill people people. Kevin signed my arm, which now that I'm thinking about it, I should have just had him sign my shirt. I was also thinking about getting it tattooed, but I didn't. Also, oh my god, so... So there's this rapper, Kembe, and they actually released an album together. Him and Hippie Sabotage, they released an album together, and he was there. We met him too, and oh my gosh, it was so funny. He signed my friend's passport, and he found it hilarious. We all did, honestly. He was like, yo, you gotta send this to me. So she took like a picture or a video, I don't remember what, and he gave her his phone number. The funny thing too is they were totally like vibing. Kimbe and my bestie it was so cute. I was like, yes, girl, go. She got his number and she sent him a video or photo. I don't even know what she took, but we were like, oh my God, we should see if maybe they're down to smoke. Since we got his number, we kind of have like a hookup, you know? So we were like, fuck it. let's." ask them to smoke. I don't know exactly if like him and the brothers were all together after the show, but we were like, fuck it, let's just see. Maybe we can hang out with all of them. Like what the fuck, that'd be so dope. So we texted him and he was like, yeah, sounds good. We were like, okay, cool. Yeah, we got the weed, you know, like let's do it. They were texting a little bit, but then he kind of just slowly started to respond later and later. It would be like 30 minutes later and then like an hour later, he'll finally respond. And then finally, Finally, like 3, 4 a.m. came around and it just didn't happen. They ended up packing their stuff and leaving. And like I said, I don't even know if he was with the brothers or not. Either way, it still would've been cool to kick it with him and smoke with him, even if the boys weren't there, you know? I show a clip of her texting him in the video. That's what was going on. Yeah, anyways, my boyfriend ended up coming. We left the hotel the next day, early in the morning, and then we went to the ocean, had a little sesh, and then left. It was such a good time. The concert was so amazing. I wanna go back to it so badly. I can't wait until I see them again, which I know I will see them again, hopefully in my hometown. If not, that's fine. Also, when I was talking to them, I was completely blinking, and I was so anxious and nervous. We didn't even get pictures with them because we just completely forgot to ask because we were just so anxious. <laughs> Next time I'm gonna get pictures with them and have them sign my shirt or something. But yeah, anyways, I actually have some goodies that I want to open up right now. I'm sorry if you're sick of me showing new products, but this is actually something that I've really been needing desperately. And I thought we would open this up together and look at this. I have a little box right here. I'm really happy about this though, because like I said, this is something that I've really been needing. We got two grinders in here. I've been needing a new grinder so badly. Not like there's anything wrong with the grinder I'm using now, but I've just been really wanting like a bigger, good quality grinder. And honestly, I feel like I've never really had a good quality grinder. <laughs> Ooh, I'm excited to see what these look like. 
cake. This is from Zam, Zam Grinders. They put this in a cute little bag. She is heavy. Oh, oh my gosh, look at this. Oh, there it is, Zam. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a nice grinder, I can tell. Here's the inside of it. I feel like having a good grinder too is really important just because it's something that I use all the time. It's pretty much like a main accessory for smoking. And I think having one that will last you a long time is important. I think these are the same thing. Yeah, these are the same thing. I don't know why I'm thinking this one looks different. It doesn't. There's no compartment for the keef though. That's different. Does anybody else forget? Cause I always forget about the keef compartment and grinders. I can go like a whole year without checking it because I just completely forget about it. It's just not something that I like use often, I guess, or think about. They also sent me two extra little like silicone rings. I'm pretty sure this is so the grinder doesn't get stuck, you know, because grinders can get kind of sticky over time. My multicolored purple one, like my OG grinder, honestly don't even know where that's at. That grinder is so hard to open because it's so sticky when you try to twist it open. It's so hard to get that fucker open. I think that's why I don't really use it anymore. Having something like this is actually nice. There's already one on here, but you can see what I mean right here on the edge. I'm excited, yay, I finally have a good grinder. We should test this out and grind some tree. I'm not gonna smoke, we're just gonna test it out. Got some tree. Just to clarify, I went on their website and this is the Zam three piece full mag grinder. It's aluminum, aluminum, aluminum. This shit is just so heavy duty. Like fuck, I can just like knock someone out with this. Let's test this out. Anybody else hate breaking apart big giant nugs because they're just so perfect and pretty and I don't want to rip them apart. Got the tree. So fucking smooth, yes. Oh my God, my old grinder could never. Yep, there it is. Some grinded tree, nice and grinded. <laughs> Yay, I'm excited to have a new grinder. Thank you so much, Zam, for sending me these grinders. I appreciate it. I don't have a coupon code for y'all to use, but they did want me to let you know. There's a 20% discount automatically applied at checkout. So yeah, that's dope. You can get 20% off your order. Yay! I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and hanging out with me today. 420's coming up. Let me know what you're doing for 420. Also, let me know down below if you know Hippie Sabotage or if you have a favorite song of theirs, let me know. Comment down below your favorite song. That's what I meant to say. I feel like I said that so confusing. Thank you again for watching. I hope you have a great day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Peace.